YouTube family. The drill movement doesn't stop. The drill movement keeps going and going and going. A rapper by the name of Shy Wits. I don't want to mess it up, but it's K Flocker's homie. We do know that. K Flocker homie unfortunately met his death this past weekend. We're going to go over it and talk about it. And before we do, you know how we do over here. Let's show some love to the legend that he seemed to be amongst his peers. So let's rewind this up and listen to how the homie sounded on the tracks on the 16th. And rest in peace to that man. Let's start this show the right way. Now this young rapper that you're watching here right now, the young rapper unfortunately met his demise. Uh, he, he, he's associates of the now incarcerated rapper K Flocker. This Bronx rapper that he was, he was rising real quick. Um, his death is still a lot of missing things involved in it, but they're telling us that the rapper was mentioned via social media by a person who claims to be the rapper's best friend. And there was a post featuring a young woman with the rapper that said, really lost my friend. I never thought I'd be riding rest in peace next to your name no time soon. Ish, really crazy out here. And speaking of how brazy it is out there, I can contest to that that New York is really brazy right now. But not only that, with the death of many of their faces of the drill movement, it's a lot of people recently been taking hits. We know Nas Blicky just took a hit. T Dot unfortunately lost his life, and a whole lot of back and forths going on, man. And the city is probably in a whirlwind right now. Let's not even whoop to do it. You feel what I'm saying? No CJ, no CJ, no disrespect to him. I mean like no whoop -de -doo. I'm talking about no whoop to do like no tricks. It ain't fake. The dudes is really becoming stains out here and people really playing with it like it's a joke when it ain't. It's not honestly sad. And this dude was 17 years old, not 18, correction. He was only 17. Let's go back to the article again and read some more. They're saying reports related to the cause of death for Shy have been limited, with many speculating the rapper was shot and killed. The rapper was on the rise in New York drill music scene, with Shy contributing to the resurgence along with other rappers like K Flock. K Flock, y'all do know about. Now, they want us to stay tuned for more updates, but we're gonna keep finding more into the situation. We do know the rapper is part of the DOA affiliate and he's no longer with us now, unfortunately. It, it, it's the whole situation. Before I continue reading more, I just wanted to shout out to the people who want to do things the right way, who understand what one false bad move could do and ricochet through a whole neighborhood. I'm mean, talking about family getting hurt right here. Now, the circumstances, like I said, was weird and it remains mysterious. But many people believe there was the back and forth with his affiliates that got him in this situation. Basically, y'all know what they're trying to say. With his ops, we all know who the ops are. Now, the teenage rap star was on the brink of national success, making a name for himself. You feel me? With all the affiliations he had. You know, last year, he had hits like Demons. It was well received from the fans, in addition to a few other records that the Bronx rapper had. Now... It was his girlfriend, I think, or girl. We know this continues a troubling trend of shooting-related deaths in the hip-hop community. In the last year, we have said goodbye to Young Dolph, Wa Wavy Pooh, uh, T. Dot Wu, Slim 400, and a whole lot, and they won't be the last. Best believe this ain't gonna be the last. It's a domino effect, y'all. As you know, the hip-hop New York community continues to react to Shy's passing. We send our sincerest condolences from the I Smoke Hip Hop Live platform and from me, DJ Bless One, to the rapper's family, friends, and loved ones, and collaborators, and fans as well. I mean, we're going to scroll through some tribute of the rapper, what went on. I just want y'all to uh, read it with me. It's a lot of sadness with that situation. You know, many people like you say, bro, what the F going on? You feel me? Mad talent. Uh, Taz Flocker said, I woke up, shy, shy passed away. 
and Assault Swifty he said, rest in peace, limit peso, got something to you. You feel me? It really hurt me. The same age as me, bro. Shy. That's it. Died. I'm going to sleep. You ninjas don't even understand the hours I got listening to this. MF. All the videos I got with his music. You can see somebody sincerely hurt. Another person, Grizzly, said, Woke up to Shy dying, man. He got out to rest in peace. Shy. It's just getting sad, man. New York is getting worse and worse. To say, uh, I mean, uh, worse too. Stay safe, y'all. Most definitely, man. Stay safe if you can get out the way and make sure you stay true, man. Because this revolutionary lies, real movement seem as other different states of trying to outdo each other. I mean, it been going on, but now dudes are being rewarded handsomely. With finances of incomes of a whole lot The drill movement is paying off And it's paying its dividends Most definitely Dudes ain't just getting a bag Dudes is getting empire, status, clout They like to call it But clout, you can make fun of this word Terminology of clout Clout has become the new record of things Clout has now been the new monetary gains of things And you can clearly see it It truly is Clout is something that we can't define other than part of the new generation, the new wave. You're either in or you're out. What's popping now? It doesn't matter what happened back in 1992, 2002, or even 2012. Like the young folks like to say, the drill movement is about moving folks out the way and only letting the ops and the goons come out and play. I mean, if this is what they say, this is what they're doing out here, the elimination game is getting played. You feel me? This ain't a video game. This is a sincerely a serious situation. Moms and dads are hurt. Brothers and sisters is having a pain that can't be described. Kids out there missing dads and fathers and mothers. And it's to the streets, to the slum slum of something that ain't even catching or reacting. You feel what I'm saying? Most of y'all can't catch the lingo, but a lot of y'all understand the hurt, the pain, and the tiresome never ending of this. It's madness, I tell you. And it's something that we gotta fix, man. It's not is what it is, it's what it was. And rest in peace to that young man. Shout out to his folks. If y'all know a solution to this, leave it in the comment section and tell me what y'all think should happen. You know, how we can get a resolution and a solution to all this. Because I think it's too much. One death is enough. But having the entirety of it back and forth like that. I mean, at this point, it's even past the movie. You can't call it a movie anymore. You got to call it what it is. It's educational purpose genocide you know what i'm saying when the world is looking at this and it's a full in a full spectrum it's not even like a zoo because even in the zoo people are protected in that zoo the animals are protected this is not the brooklyn zoo the yonka zoo it's none of that the bronx zoo the harlem zoo no new york zoo no drill movement nah it's none of that it's a uh, sustainability and a way of life for many people and, and for them whatever your world is this apparently is their world it's drilling and moving out and about but it's not just about drilling when i say drilling i'm not talking about the bodies i'm talking about the family the friends they pick up the maturation process of growing up in that type of slum so you're gonna have friendship and a loyalty that others would not understand unless you out there getting dirty too in those streets we do know the streets gotta eat like the og once said a long time ago the streets gotta eat the streets is undefeated it's married to nobody it has no loyalty the loyalty has been expired many moons ago many many moons ago there ain't no loyalty in this it's a trap and you play the game to lose you don't play it to win even if you play it to win you end up losing only very few make it out and you don't want to know what they do to make it out you feel me so ladies and gentlemen this is the demise of a young gifted artist a young gifted man a young gifted brother a young gifted all that it's bigger than hip-hop it's real life painted pictures on a canvas no more emptiness you understand me that's why at the end of all my videos i tell you to love your family love your kids and truly most indeed stay blessed Stay blessed, y'all. Get out the way. You heard me? That make him a door.